So we're going to now demonstrate the same side PSA for the right-handed operator. And we're going to um, practice retraction. So we're going to place our gauze in the corner of the patient's mouth. Then we're going to take our index finger and we're going to push past the gauze and we're going to take the tip of our finger and touch the maxillary tuberosity. Now, the PSA retraction is really important that you get the vestibule wide open. So you have to keep your finger way back, touching the maxillary tuberosity, and then you're going to literally slide your finger into the vestibule, keeping your finger way back, okay? And then you're going to grab the cheek up high with your thumb and hook your finger forward. So you're kind of making a C with that retraction. Now, your patient's going to want to come with you because the pull is quite um, hard but you wanna make sure that your patient stays straight up and down or slightly away from you when you're doing the retraction. Now the patient's gonna close and shift their jaw toward you to give you more room in that vestibule. Okay, let's go ahead and pick up our syringe. We're gonna reach back, touch the maxillary tuberosity, slide our finger, nope, you came down. You gotta stay up high. Now slide right up in that vestibule. Keep that finger up there, good. Now you're gonna hook your finger forward, perfect. I like it, okay. Now we're gonna go in the one position, you're gonna clear the lip. You can't touch that needle to anything but your penetration site. So you're gonna get it back there, then you're gonna swing your arm towards your body you're gonna to touch the barrel to your finger, but not the needle at all. Make sure that your barrel is up so that the examiners can really visualize that open barrel, okay? Now, we are at a 45 degree angle to the distal buccal cusp of the second molar. Minimum penetration site. I see, proceed. Now she's about halfway, she's gonna drop the barrel towards her shoulder and the needle's gonna go in an upward position and she's using her retraction finger to control the barrel so we don't have bowing of the needle. Okay, and now she's at her maximum depth and angle which is four millimeters showing from the hub to the tissue. Maximum depth and angulation. I see, proceed. Aspirating. Negative. I see, proceed. Depositing. Okay. So she's going to hold now. She is at a she is at a 45 degree angle from the mid sagittal plane, and she her barrel is lined up with the ala of the nose, and that is a perfect PSA. Okay, you can withdraw. So we're going to come out halfway and kind of lift up as you withdraw. And again, when you pull that needle out, don't touch it to anything—not your glove, don't rub it against the lip. Just control that syringe.